Hi guys, Gilliam Elliott here. I want to come to you guys today with three main factors that are attracting patients to medical tourism. Now, I know a lot of people think that it's just exotic destinations or patients are just attracted to the industry just to uh, recover on a uh, on an island somewhere. And it is those things, uh, people are attracted to those things, but it's a lot more uh, factors as well. And while there are a lot of factors, I just wanna to touch on the three main factors that we see uh, patients traveling for medical tourism. Now, I live here in America. So it's no secret that Americans pay the highest cost for medical treatment. So you see a lot of Americans traveling all around the world, uh, traveling all around the globe to get access to more affordable health care. Um, and so that's no that's not just for America. Uh, it's, it's a lot of first world countries. Uh, they have high cost for health care. So they travel to developing countries uh, to get access to uh, affordable health care and also um, countries that are known for having a good standard of health care as well because there's no benefit of saving money in getting a uh, botched procedure. So that's the reason why we see Americans traveling uh, and we also see a lot of other countries uh, traveling for affordable health care. The next reason why we see patients travel is for better quality of health care. Now this goes into trying to get access to the latest technologies. Uh, maybe the procedure isn't available in their country, so they travel to another country that has uh, the latest technology or has access to certain treatments that might not be available in their home country. Now um, another reason why we see uh, patients traveling, and this goes to uh, better quality of health care, is uh, I'm just going to give an example of stem cells. We see a lot of patients whose stem cells might not be legal in their country, so they travel to another country uh, to get stem cell treatment, or they travel to another country to get uh, pharmaceuticals that they might not be able uh, to get in their uh, in their home country, or access to prescriptions that aren't uh, approved yet in their country. So this is this falls under the umbrella of better quality of care. Um, a lot of Russian patients we see, just for an example, they travel to places like China. You see Russian patients traveling to India, uh, Russian patients traveling to Germany, um, Israel. You see them traveling all around the world because the healthcare system in uh in Russia isn't uh, isn't the highest quality, so they travel outside. And that's just an example. You have a lot of other countries. Um, just thinking right now, uh, earlier today, we had a patient that I posted on the member's website. Uh, it was a patient from Dubai. Uh, he was going to Thailand because Thailand's known for having, uh, a, having a great healthcare system with affordable rates. Um, so you see people from all around the world uh, traveling to uh, to other places to get better uh, better access or better care when it comes to medical treatments. The next reason we see patients traveling is uh, is to avoid long wait lines. Now this goes into countries like the United Kingdom. Um, to Canada, just to name a couple. Um, these countries have long wait times um, for people to get uh, get treatments. So imagine having an agonizing pain uh, that that's bothering you every day, and you're on this long wait list. Um, I recall seeing, remember seeing someone that was on a wait list for uh, upward of six months. So. They, six months, they have this pain and they're waiting on this list, not knowing when they're going to get access to health care. And they found out about medical tourism. They came through our website, asked questions. We connected them with our members. And instead of having to wait another three, six months, they got access. They got on a plane. They flew to another country and they got the health care uh, treatment that they needed for an affordable rate. This is just an example of uh, of long wait list uh, in countries where uh, people really need uh, health care treatments, but they have to wait. And so they opt to do medical tourism. So that's the that's the last reason of the three reasons. So just to go over the three reasons is cost savings. Um, it is um, better quality of care. And then it's to avoid long wait lines. These are the main three reasons why we see patients drawn to medical tourism. And as I said, it's a, it's a whole host of other reasons, but these are the main factors that we see most patients uh, inquiring about and the reason why they're interested in the industry. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video today. Uh, if you're looking to attract more international patients, uh, maybe you're just joining the medical tourism industry and you're looking to get access to resources like educational resources or uh, educational tools, uh, documents that can help you in the medical tourism industry, or maybe you're just looking for, um, for online marketing for your website or, or Google ranking. Uh, I'm going to leave some links below for you guys to reach out to us directly and keep an eye out for our videos. We're going to keep bringing them to you.